Hi everyone, this is Sherry with Corset Q&A episode number 81. Can't believe we made it that far. Good morning, Kaylin. How are you this morning? Oh, I'm doing great. How's it going? It's going really well. What's the question you have for me today? Um, so I was thinking about starting waist training. Okay. Um, and I just wanted to know how often I should wear it to kind of get the results I want and to maintain them. To maintain them. So there's a difference between like getting the results that you want and then maintaining the results that you want. So when you're trying to really start your waist training, um, you really need to wear your corset almost daily. You know, your results will come faster the longer that you wear your corset. Now, to maintain the results, so say you've been corseting now for two years and you have whittled your waist down and you're really happy with your results and now you want to know, well, how often do I need to keep wearing it? You know, we tell people all the time that, that corseting is sort of like braces, right? After you, if you take your braces off and you never wear your retainer, I didn't. Oh, uh, see, you know what happens then, right? <laughs> yeah. Your teeth, they okay. come right back to where they used to go. Well, sense. the same thing will happen, you know, with, with your waist, because we say that's a semi-permanent change. So especially if you've really done some pretty intense waist training and you brought in those lower ribs even and you really, if you go uncorseted for months at a time, eventually that's going to move back out again. But there's no one right answer for how often you have to wear your corset um, in order to maintain that result. It's a little bit different for everyone. Mm -hmm. Some people actually lose weight while they're waist training. You know, there's a lot of things that can happen when you're changing your body shape. So some of that might be a little bit more permanent for you versus somebody else. But everybody's going to have to do at least a little bit of maintenance training a couple of times a week where you're wearing your corset for a few hours at a time. All right? All right. Sounds good. Thanks, Kaylin. Thanks. Thank you so much for watching this Q&A. Make sure you check out our other Q&A and Corset 101 videos here on our YouTube channel. And tumble on over to our Tumblr page. I hear that's really amazing over there. Thank you so much for watching.